Hello and welcome to Subnautica. I'm Rika from Hannibal Games and this is a new series. Subnautica is an open world underwater game. Well, obviously Subnautica kind of gives you gives name gives it away. Uh, where you can, uh, you know, build stuff, make uh, some habitats uh, inside the water and all that. You're, the story goes basically you crash land and now you are stuck in the water. I did try the game. Played it for about two hours. It's it's pretty darn fun actually, and there was a big update uh, recently. I'm not sure what the update was because I didn't play the game before. So yeah, I kind of didn't research that. Oh, it actually detects my video card. That's that's this. Uh, so let's go into the survival. Avoid dangerous creatures, find resources, manage hunger and thirst to survive. Let's go survival. The loading takes a long, long, long time. So. Yeah, bear with me, uh, it, it does take a while. I'll be back when this thing loads up. Oh, as you can see, that was a cutscene into the game. That's the first thing you actually see. So, yeah, let's see what's going on here. There's a fire. We we are kind of stuck. Okay, we're not stuck. And there we go. Yeah. Okay. Uh, extinguish the fire. Pick up the the thing. Use the right right mouse button. To extinguish the fire. Okay, that seems fine for now. There we go. That's a good boy. Okay, so he's looking at his iPad. <laughs> well, it's not iPad, it's something futuristic. I kind of hate the Apple and hopefully iPad will not survive in the future. Just a personal reference because a few jobs I had really big issues with them So that's why I started hating them and they're all priced anyway in my country Okay, so fire extinguisher keeps fire in check. Yeah, okay Yeah, familiarize yourself. Yeah, I got it. Okay, so here's inventory. Here's our equipped stuff Here are the blueprint stuff you can make plastiling it. What the hell is that? Uh, here's a voice log Photo album for screenshots, data bank for uh, stuff. I didn't, I didn't quite get it. What's this for? Anyway, um, yeah, let's go outside. This thing crashed. This is the escape pod, and we survived. Let's go down here. Okay, and this is underwater stuff. <gasps> oh my god! I didn't actually try this. <laughs> so freaking awesome. Uh, but anyway. We're not gonna need the fire extinguisher, so I'm gonna go into here because that's a random thing you got here. You have some water, you have some rations, um, which is good, 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 good. But I'm gonna go out, and water gets uh, a bit problematic. So first of all, let's uh, kind of get this guy. That's like. Uh, Material, you get titanium out of it. Okay, so this, every time the world is a bit different. Because when I was playing that two hour thing, I wasn't so close to this uh, hill. Let's call it a hill. I have no idea how you call stuff here, so sorry about that. Um, now we can, I don't know, go. I do know we will need. Something that's located towards this Aurora. This big guy is called Aurora. So, or is it? Maybe it's not. Damn. But anyway, oh, quartz. We're gonna need that. You shouldn't pick up everything because inventory is pretty darn tight. You have to be careful with that. Did this thing just drop onto somewhere? What is that? Okay, but I'm gonna try and catch some. 
fish, but yeah, I can catch it. I'm quite slow. The thing is, I'm looking for big ass wines with glowy stuff on them, and I think that's it. I think I found them. I think I found them. Oh, look at this thing. That's a gold mine right there. Pick up metal salvage. How many meters? I have enough. I'm gonna take it actually. Just one. Cargo. I cannot take that. Let's go up here. I need those bubblies. Glowing stuff. Uh, but the thing is, if I get close to the Aurora. Oh shit. He's aggressive. He is aggressive, so be careful on that. If I get too close, I'm gonna start receiving damage because of the radiation, because of the generator leak and stuff like that. So I'm gonna grab as much as this guy's I can. Whoa, shit, he's coming for me. He's coming for me. Oh, he's not. Okay, he is not coming for me. The thing is, I hit. Yeah, I'm gonna grab this thing as well. So yeah, the radiation is going on and all that. Oh, this is salt. We're gonna need that as well. Oh, 10 seconds of oxygen. Oh shit, oh shit. I've never drowned actually. I think that's a big plus for me. Ah uh, yeah, he's choking. Well, kinda. Um... Okay, so let's go down there. I saw limestone I wanted to break. Oh, there we go. Break limestone. You get some various... I got copper right now. You get some various uh, or uh, some minerals, not ores. Oh, yeah, same thing. Now I'm actually going back into my escape pod, which is there. You can see the... Oh, it's bubbling up. I'm gonna have to catch those fishes. I'm gonna see why. Because right now the priority is... Food and water and eventually well before that kind of I want fins and a knife fins to be able to swim faster and a knife to knife some stuff out okay come on There we go. Okay, so you make stuff here into this guy. Fabricator. There we go. Basic materials. Titanium. He's gonna take the metal salvage I got and make it into titanium. So if I look my inventory, yeah, I got uh, torn apart. But I'm also gonna make silicon rubber. It needs two of those big guys. It's actually pretty darn good because of the the inventory uh, stuff and that uh, so yeah come on make it make it make it I'm gonna make all the silicon rubber I can to save up on the inventory space there we go uh, I'm gonna place the rest here now I'm gonna make some equipment equipment pins there we go I think it's automatically equipped I'm also gonna need Oxygen tank, so I'm gonna need some glass, and for glass, I need two quartz, I only have one. Yeah, it automatically uh, equipped my fins, that's awesome, I'm way faster now. And I see some quartz, we're gonna need that. There we go, got some quartz. Because oxygen is kind of a problem, if, because I want to be in the water as much as possible. Uh, Oh yeah, medical kit. I could heal myself. There we go. So now resources make some glass. Eat something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't tell me what to do. Uh, equipment. O2 tank. There we go. And there we go. I'm just gonna put in the materials inside. Now, the thing is, since I play this game a bit for two hours, I kind of know what I need, what I'm searching for. Uh, so yeah, this fish can be cooked. No, these guys can be cooked, but they're pretty darn fast. Boomerang. 
recipe is good for cooking. Uh. And there, some. Oh, th oh, that's a peeper. I think it's called a peeper. By the way, you see this guy? He is water. You can uh, transfer him into water. That is pretty darn useful. Peeper is good for food as well as this boomerang guy. Okay, so I'm gonna. See if I can find more of the watery guys. Uh, okay. Oh, acid mushroom. Mushroom. I didn't want to take that. To be honest. Uh, but yeah, let's go inside. Ooh, look at this thing. It's quartz. Right here below us. So I'm gonna go inside. I'm gonna store the quartz. And this mushroom. And gonna cook these fishes. And wait a minute actually. Water. See, filtered water you need air sac. This guy is the air sac. Yep. So, water, air sac. There we go. So, first bottle of water we made. Cooked food. You can cook air sac, but since he's our water uh, resource guy, we're not gonna cook him. We're gonna cook some peepers. That's the fast one. And now we're gonna eat him. You should eat as soon as you cook it, because it does the great over time. But so yeah, today we kind of uh, got some basic, basic, basic uh, equipment. Managed to get some food and water going. Well, not going, but yeah, we have some food and water. That's the important thing. And in the next episode, I'm going to continue hunting down fishes, make some equipment and stuff like that. So today, that's going to be it. So thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe, leave a comment, like the video and see you next time.